Hey guys! Oh my gosh, I have missed y'all so much. Give me a hug, give me a hug. Oh. <laughs> Welcome to another weekly vlog, you guys. I have missed y'all so freaking much. I'm gonna tell y'all where I've been, what's been going on, but first, let's go and hear from a word from our sponsor. So, huge thank you to GlassesUSA.com for sponsoring this portion of today's vlog. So I got two pair of glasses that I'm about to show you guys from glassesusa.com. Absolutely love. I'm gonna go through what they, what each of them do and what and whatnot and what I'm specifically using them for. But I wanna go ahead and tell you a little bit more about glassesusa.com. So by cutting out the middleman, glassesusa.com offers over 10,000 prescription glasses and sunglasses, including in-house brands like Muse, and Amelia E and design, designer brands like Ray-Ban, Oakley, Gucci, and many, many more at up to 70% off of retail prices. So you also have a risk-free shopping experience. Shopping online at glassesusa.com means a risk-free shopping experience. You get free shipping and returns. 100% money back guarantee within 14 days. You can take a quiz if you're feeling overwhelmed by the amount of choices that they have on their website. The quiz takes only about a minute and it suggests the right pair of glasses based on your face shape and needs. And you can take the quiz again right on their website, glassesusa.com. They have blue light blocking glasses and they're basically ideal for protecting your eyes at work, home, outdoors, as they also include glare prevention and UV block. They also have a virtual try on tool, which is so incredibly easy, you guys. All you do is go onto their website, glassesusa.com and you just go to their virtual try on tool, you upload a picture or you can even do it where you do it live and you can virtually try on your glasses, which I absolutely love. So yeah, super easy, pain free. These are my old women glasses, y'all. I have officially joined the I need old women's old people glasses. <laughs> I now have old eyes so like now when I'm like showing you guys my makeup stuff I can be like oh and I don't have to be like no I, I can read it y'all I can read it so yeah I got these uh magnifying and they also have the blue light and all of that stuff so absolutely love these ones are just blue light so protect your eyes from tv computer your phone all of that so yeah links down below for you guys to check out glassesusa.com also any discount codes and everything are going to be linked down below in the description box so make sure you go down there and get you some get you some glasses and some contacts from glassesusa.com okay so y'all let me tell you something i was sick as a dog Oh my gosh, I was so freaking sick. Why, why is that an expression? Sick as a dog? What does that even mean? I was really sick. Okay, laid out, couldn't do anything. Uh, nose, ear, all kind of sinus stuff. Ugh, just felt awful. No energy. <sighs> just really, 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 really awful. Okay, and then on top of that, y'all know I still have my bum foot. It's starting to feel a little bit better. But it's not at 100% yet, so I'm not able to exercise yet. So y'all, no work, no play, no nothing. I have been, my mental health has not been the best, I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, I'm definitely feeling better. I'm glad that I'm able to like leave the house. I wasn't able to like leave the house because like I live on the third floor, so trying to like really have this heel stay off of it as much as possible no sun I mean it was it was just it was bad okay but I'm back I made it through I made it through it was hard it was hard I'm not gonna lie it was hard some of those days but um TikTok had me laughing I made sure to like watch stuff that would have me laughing so that way I wouldn't be so in you know in this you know because once you take the sun and my workouts away oh girl like 
it's just not a good combo. So anyways, I'm not at 100% yet. I still have this thing on, this little boot. I have here and there when I leave the house, like Saturday I had to leave the house for a little bit and I wore my Nikes on both of my feet and it hurt a little bit, but not too, too, too bad. So I'm gonna do that again today just because I'm tired of like having to like limp and like walk slower and all that kind of stuff. And I shouldn't be doing too much walking while I'm out today, but today I'm going, my kids have a teacher work day, so they're off today. So we're gonna go to Target, Goodwill, I organized my whole entire kitchen yesterday, you guys. I finally had somewhat a little bit of energy yesterday and I just ran with it. So we organized the fridge, we organized the cabinets, the pantry. Oh my gosh, the, the ca it looks so freaking good. I decluttered, oh, the pantry looks amazing. I also organized and decluttered my little laundry closet because that started to become like a catch-all for like all the snacks all the drinks I was able to fit them in the pantry it looks so good so I'm gonna give you I'm gonna show you guys a little clip of what I took yesterday I took that footage from my weight loss channel but I was like I'm just gonna go ahead and insert it here because y'all need to see how good it looks I wish I had I don't think I did it before of the I may not even have done an after so if I did not do an after when I'm editing Jill if you haven't done an after of the pantry do one now but I think I did but I don't think I did it before but I girl I did it before of that fridge <laughs> it was bad um so anyways yeah we are back um but yeah I love you guys thank you for being patient oh my gosh it was ugh. So um, I'm still kind of like congested a little bit, but I feel so much better, so much better. So I'm gonna show you my outfit because y'all, like I was, so, I was so tired of being in workout clothes, pajamas. I would get in the shower and then I would just like throw my hair up and just, I looked atrocious all last week. I didn't have my nails on. So last night I put my nails on, I, I washed my hair and then I blow dried it. I was like, mm, I already feel like a new woman. And then this morning I was like, let me put on a cute outfit. Like I don't want to wear, even though I still have to wear my Nikes, I don't want to, I don't, I don't want to wear my workout clothes. I just want to wear something cute. So I have some jeans and this cute little shirt on. I'm so excited. So I'm going to show you my little outfit. Okay. So here's the outfit. This shirt I think I got it from Walmart. These jeans are from Venus. Oh my gosh, I'm able to wear jeans again because it's only 76, well, shit, it's 76 out, so it's probably, a, it's definitely a lot warmer than I thought it was gonna be. But that's okay, that's okay. We're still gonna wear our jeans. And here are my Nikes. So my foot, like I said, it's like, it's better. I just don't wanna walk too, too, too much. And then when I get home, I will just put the little, brace thing back on it but yeah that's my outfit we already saw my makeup i got this little mama necklace which i'll link down below and let's go let's leave the house let's go get some sun okay it is 2 36 my son is gone we went to what's that place called goodwill if i got a couple of things y'all I don't know if it was before Goodwill. I can't really remember. But my energy level, ugh. this is the thing with these colds. Is you like, I think you're starting to feel better and then your body's like, nope, nope, not happening. But I already promised Ava that we would go. So here I am being a sport. And all I wanna do is take a nap. <laughs> Uh, I still am feeling a whole ton better than I was, so I'll take it, but yeah, me and my friends are talking today because we're planning my birthday is in two weeks. What, can we, can y'all answer this question for me? What the hell happened to September? Like, are you freaking kidding me? mind blown I don't know I don't know what happened to it I don't know what happened to it so here we are in almost October and I was like my birthday's coming up <laughs> it 
two weeks. So I was like telling my friends, I was like, I'll see you in two weeks. So we're like making plans and I'm really excited. But me and Ava are about to go, I'm about to go to Target, Dollar Tree. I'm trying to find this thing my, my friend was telling me that I could put ice in, you know, because I'm supposed to be icing my foot twice a day for 15 minutes at a time. And there's that. My foot is actually feeling not so bad today. Like when I was going down the stairs and up the stairs, it really didn't hurt at all with my sneakers. So the past couple of days that I went somewhere, it was hurting a little bit. So that's good. But should I put on some rings? Yeah. yeah, I should. Let's do it. Let's do it. Because I just feel... I feel I feel good today. I think I'm gonna do this one. It's really cute. I love this ring. It's not very comfortable. I love the way it looks though, but it's it's not the most comfortable on my hand, that's for sure. Um, I need to get a new watch band because y'all see this. It looks horrendous. Um, hi kids. And then I think I'm just gonna do this one right there. Or I could do this one. Doing it to match with my earrings, even though that doesn't, it's whatever. Oh, is this too big now? It feels like, hey, Bella. Hey, Bella. <laughs> like, should I do, no. One or the other. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by its toe. Is it fun as someone go? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. I don't know. Uh, I think I'm just going to do this one. This one's really pretty, though, too. Hey, Bella. She's like, give me attention. We're about to leave, sweet girl. All right. I will see you guys later. I will. I don't know if I'm going to get anything from Starbucks. We're going to go to Starbucks first. I'm going to say, if I get something, I should get something. I should get hot tea instead of cold tea. I just iced my foot. I had to come on here and tell you guys about these. Oh my goodness. Okay, so Built Bar sponsored me all last year, which was such a huge blessing. And I ate one like literally like every day for a year. I was just obsessed with them, okay? Like they would send me Built Bars, but then I also would buy them on my own because they're just, they're so freaking good. So... You know, I started WW Weight Watchers and I was like, I need to change the way that I'm eating and I need to figure out how to be able to like include sweets and include my favorite foods without such high points. Like literally, I was like, let me go ahead and get a cake pop at Starbucks. Let me just go ahead and get one. Eight points for like, it's literally this big. And I was like, mm, yeah, no. And this is what I'm loving about WW is the fact that I, it's really, okay, so like doing calorie counting, say it's 150 calories, I would have been like, oh, okay, 150, I, don't, I really don't know how many calories they are, but I would have worked it in. I would have worked it in today. But when you see nine points, like, do you know how much food I could eat for nine points if it was, like, protein and, you know, like, I could just eat so much more food. So I was like, no. So that's where Built Bar came in. Now, I did spend, these things are not, they're, they're expensive, but they're so good. They're so freaking good. This one, okay, so this is, these are the ones that I got. Alright, I used to get, um, there was the, uh, I don't think I have any more of them, but it was a cookie dough, and it was the Built Bar, like, just the regular protein bar. Now they've come out with these granola bars. I don't remember all the flavors, but the one that I got was chocolate coconut. Guys, I'm telling you, four points. Four points! And it has, I think it's 17 grams of protein. 
15 grams of protein, 150 calories, okay, four points. Now these ones, okay, so I like the puffs because to me, the puffs like taste like chocolate covered marshmallows. They're so freaking good. They have the consistency of a marshmallow, not as sweet as a marshmallow. Still so, so, so good. So when I saw that they had the cookie dough chunk puffs, I was like, are you kidding me? Now, I will say these ones on WW, these ones are a little higher. I want to say these ones are six. Yeah, this one's six points, which is kind of weird because I'm like, why? This one's 160 calories, 15 grams of protein. I think this one has more sugar than this one. Got to get it from the bottom. This one is the... Built Bar Puffs Brownie Batter. This one has 140 calories, three grams of fat. Yeah, this one I feel like is all sugar. No, because it says six grams of sugar alcohol. So y'all, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's a... This one doesn't have any fiber. See, the way that WW comes up with their point calculation, I don't know. But you could have very similar macros. And if something is not, it's a considerable difference. Like this is a two point difference from this and this. So I'm just saying, honestly, if I would have known, no, I still would have gotten these because I love me some cookie dough. But I, I want to let you know they don't sponsor they haven't sponsored me I haven't been sponsored by them in forever I I use my old coupon code if you guys I mean they have so many different coupon codes I'm gonna see if I can find one or like I don't think you can be an affiliate with them or maybe I should contact them I don't know but I'll have a, some kind of code down below I think it gives me like free points if you purchase you don't have to purchase from me you can just go on built bar I just recommend them because they're freaking delicious and incredible my old code was like taking weight off 10 if you want to use that i think that you might be able to find some 15 percent off coupon codes but highly recommend i'm about to have one and i just wanted to tell you guys this granola bar now it is not like those like quaker chocolate covered granola bar goodness that is just like oh like classic just so good but this is this is really freaking good in a different kind of way. Like, let me show you the inside. That's what the inside looks like. It's just so good. The texture, the taste, delicious. Delicious. I don't even know if it's like, my taste buds are coming back. I didn't have COVID. Just had a head cold but you know like when all your sinuses are all messed up like I, I really couldn't taste anything i couldn't smell anything so slowly it's coming back and i'm just like i love the texture of this it's almost kind of like caramelly texture in the middle and like oatmeal oh, it's just so good not like oatmeal but like a granola bar hey guys happy tuesday so it's 10 30 um i'm feeling better today energy my my energy levels were weird yesterday they they would dip and then they'd be like okay and then they would dip really low like the whole time that i was out yesterday i felt like crap i didn't like feel bad i just felt tired like really just drained of all energy and then when I went home and I iced my foot and I like chilled for a little bit, I was like, I feel so much better. So I don't know what the heck that was about, but I feel, I do feel better today. Um, I took Ava to doctor appointment. I went and dropped off some food and some clothes to a women's shelter place. Um, I always love doing that. Like it just makes me feel so good because I remember, I remember being in that place needing the women's shelter. I never stayed there, but I used a lot of their services and I will always forever. 
give back to them and now that I know that there's a place that I can go that accepts donations in all kinds of ways I'm going to as a matter of fact I might actually instead of volunteering at the other place I've been volunteering at or that I was volunteering at I might actually volunteer there because I just like to give back especially like I know I know what it's like to need those kinds of things you know um, and that stuff is like very near and dear to my heart but yeah so I just coming back from dropping off that stuff and um, I'm not really gonna do like exert much energy today I don't really have any plans except for doing some editing I got a video for tomorrow to go up for my weight loss channel and then I have two videos to edit for my weight loss channel so I'm probably gonna do Wednesday and Thursday of this week for the weight loss channel so I gotta do that and then yeah lots of editing today so you probably won't see me much but um, I did get up I got ready got in the shower I didn't do my hair quite yet like I wanted to do a little something to it but I didn't have time this morning but I did I put on some makeup um, put on some jeans it is officially jean season which I am here for I I like wearing shorts I like the fact that I'm confident enough to wear shorts now because there was a time in my life where you would not catch me dead in a pair of shorts so I like the fact that I'm kind of over that but I also I, I don't necessarily love my legs especially my knees I'm very very self-conscious not self-conscious about my knees I'm not self-conscious about it I just I don't like looking at them when I look in the mirror I'm like so yeah I'm, I'm kind of I'm really excited that it's jean season so it, it cooled off quick y'all I'm like heck yeah I think it's always supposed to be like a high of 72 today I was like, it is jean season. I wore some jeans yesterday, which y'all saw, which y'all saw, and then, um, it felt good. It felt good. And even when it got to the highest that it did yesterday, it's, I still felt good in my jeans. It didn't, it wasn't too hot for them. So, two thumbs up for that. I'm excited for that, because you know, your girl loves her some dang jeans. Um... What was I going to say? I think I might have a couple of dates this week. If you guys want to be caught up on my dates and all the stories and what's going on and all that kind of stuff, go follow me on my Patreon. It's linked down below. Um, I'm having to catch up with work this week, so I don't know. And then Friday, I have my Friday night, I have my Patreon monthly what's that thing called cops are pulling people over today i have my monthly zoom call with my third level paid third tier patreons so i have that so i can't really do anything for i mean i guess i could do something else friday night but i'm girl i'm not gonna want to this is something me and my friend were talking about it's like you want to go out on Friday night? Okay, yeah, cool. But then the Friday night comes, it's like, mm, I just want to go to bed. Hey, guys. Happy Thursday. I know it's Thursday already. Um, I was working all day yesterday. I did try-ons. Um, and then I did editing of said try-ons. And I relaxed last evening. So, yeah. It was nice. Today I'm taking myself out on a solo date. First order of business and first stop is going to be. Let's see, did that get covered up? We're gonna go to a Weight Watchers meeting, which I'm really excited for. So, Weight Watchers meeting. And then from there, I saw that there was a Trader Joe's really close. So we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. I saw on the Hungry, is it Hungry Gal? Her website that they have pumpkin gnocchi. I love gnocchi. And she said that it doesn't taste like, you know, like pumpkin, like the pumpkin spicy kind of stuff. It just tastes like creamy and 
I'm like, ooh, I want to try that. So I'm going to get a pack of that. I'm also going to try to find, it also said something about like harvest spaghetti squash spirals and I don't know. It looked, it was really low in points for Weight Watchers. So I was like, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're going to go Trader Joe's. Hopefully we can find those things. If not, girl, I'm just looking around. I love just looking around Trader Joe's. Like, ugh. I freaking love it. Like, I could literally spend hours. What's one place that you could spend hours in? For me, it's Walmart. Literally, just look at all the food. What kind of food do you have? Especially, like, the... I love, like, all of the holiday-ish stuff when they start bringing out, like, the holiday food. And um, they always have, like, this little table. And it's, like, always so fun. I love that. I love looking at all that stuff. I love looking at just... Like all the new foods down the aisles. I love looking at the clothes. I love looking at the home stuff. Oh my gosh, I could literally spend like three hours at Walmart. I kid you not. Just looking around. Just looking around. I love it. But Trader Joe's is one of those places. I just like go down every aisle and just look, see what they have, see what's new. <sighs> yeah, trying not to get too, too much um, because... Yeah, my freezer. Usually usually I get a lot of their freezer things, but my freezer is, is pretty full, so we can't really get too much. But we're going to do that, and then I'm going to go to Walmart. I have to go do... I was going to go in, but with my foot still kind of like... I don't know, like it doesn't hurt, but then it does. It's just, it's so weird what's going on with it. So, <laughs> this morning it doesn't hurt, like, hardly at all. Like, just a teeny tiny bit. I hate this. Y'all see how patchy that got right there? Oh, it's so annoying. That's what we're going to do today. We're going to go to Starbucks and we're going to get that. I don't even think I told y'all. I Did I tell y'all? That drink? The, okay, so I always, I always get it. It's an iced tango iced tango venti iced tango with three pumps of sugar-free vanilla and then i always ask for a splash of sweet cream like vanilla sweet cream i think that's what it's called y'all i'm like new to the starbucks thing like i really I, I don't know the terms and the lingo and all that kind of stuff i think that's what it's called though but i have it like in my phone because I found it from someone on TikTok who said that it tastes like strawberry milk for like very, very, very low calories. So I was like, mm, give it to me. So the first time I went, I was like, mm, and I got it. I was like, oh, it's okay. The second time I was like, mm, this is pretty good. I think that that was my fourth time. That was so good. Like I was, like I was downing it. It was so freaking good. I think that instead of doing a splash of that cream stuff, the cold foam or whatever, whatever it is. I think he did like a full on. Which, how do you find the calories for that? I would love to know because I want to know how many points because I put four points the last time I went. And I don't know if it's, I don't know. I don't know. I, I do like to be like super precise when it comes to my points and stuff like that. Even when I was like counting calories, I was like always like super precise. But yeah, that's what we're going to do. I also need to take, I have these jeans I need to take back to Burlington. Pretty much for the most part done with my face and my makeup. Uh, I, the Weight Watchers meeting is at 10. I kind of need to leave like soon. <laughs> so I don't think I'm going to be doing my eyebrows or anything to my brows. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the car. So we are here on our way to Weight Watchers. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna make it there within enough time. Um, I'm nervous to see how much it is because I feel like I need this, but then I'm scared it's gonna be like, they're gonna be like, oh, it's 60 bucks a month, and I'm gonna be like, oh. Well, I guess I'll just do digital. Um... I don't know. I don't I don't know how much it is cuz the lady like wouldn't tell me. I need to get over but then get over over. These cars are like Do 
I'm gonna go to Starbucks. I need to get over again. I haven't drove the interstate in a really long time. I haven't drove in so long, y'all. Cause we, like, Kentrell has gotten on the interstate. But, um... It's not often. It's been a couple of times, so I just, I don't drive a whole lot. Like, if we have to go somewhere and it's, like, with him, he drives. Which is good. He's over halfway through his 60 hours, um, which is great. Which you guys don't know, like, North Carolina has this, I love it, I do, but it's just very extensive the way that they have their driver's license permit situation. Anyways, I'm gonna focus on the traffic, focus on where I need to go, because I've never been here before. And I'll let you guys know how it went, what I think and what I thought, and I'm excited. Okay, so you guys, that was nice. Hello, my name is Jill. <laughs> um, Y'all, I met a subscriber there. So hey girl, hey. That was really cool. She was like, do you have people come up to you all the time? I'm like, I'm definitely more here since I moved to Charlotte than I have ever in, in Georgia, but it's always really cool. So yeah, um, I did sign up. I signed up for the six month and I get three months for free. So I'm like, heck yeah. I have to show you like all the goodies that they gave me for free. And then I also got some other things. I was going to have lunch at home, but now I'm kind of like, I kind of want to stay out because my son's got to stay. He has to stay at school today to make up a, what is this? Softies? Um, he's got to stay at school to make up a test. I'm about to take this off before I forget. And <coughs> I'm going to need to pick him up. So I don't, especially with my foot, um, update on my foot. I have my Converse on today and so far so good. Like it's not hurting super duper bad. I don't want to do like a ton of walking quite yet though, which is why I did the Walmart pickup which that should be ready. I don't know when that's gonna be ready. 12? Oh, that's not a parking spot, this one is, damn it. Um, I'm like, usually if my foot wasn't all bummed up or messed up, then I would, I guess I'll just park back this way. Trader Joe's is always so, um, it's always so packed. You know what? What the hell? I'm, I'm putting out into the universe that my my foot is healed today. It is healed. I'm going to do some walking. Um, But yeah, I really enjoyed it. Like, met a subscriber. The woman was really nice. They said that you can come as many times as you want to meetings. Everyone was super nice. I'm really excited. Like, I am, like, really, really, really excited. Um, I need to get this new lash. I'm using this new lash glue. I don't like it. The woman that was ringing me up, she was like, I can't, I can't stop looking at your eyelashes. I'm like, thanks. Usually I'd be like, oh, they're, they're fake. But now I'm, I'm just like, thank you. Um, so there's a Zoe's Kitchen right here. I've never been, but I think I might actually go to Zoe's Kitchen when I come out of Trader Joe's. So what do I have to do after this? I gotta go get food. I gotta go do a pickup. I'm still gonna have to go upstairs into my house. Because of this stuff. Well, it depends. Because I'm getting yonky from here if they have it. I'm coming back here Saturday. So I think I might just go get the gnocchi. Or maybe just walk around and see what they have. And then maybe I'll wait until Saturday since I'm coming back to Saturday's meeting. But anyways, I'm, when I get home, I'm going to do a haul of, because I got some free things from WW and I went ahead and I got some, some things too. And they were like giving me tips and all this kind of stuff. So 
All right, let's go into Trader Joe's. This has been the best solo date. Wait, when's the last time I went to a, on a solo date? Because I feel like I said that one was the best one. That one was a good one, too. I can't remember what I did, though. Oh, I went to Starbucks. I, I should have went. I should have went and got it before. Should I go? Have me a little Starbies while I go around Trader Joe's? That was my intention. I forgot. And I... I literally because it's right over there back in the car um I didn't get much because I forgot I have to go pick up my groceries from Walmart before 12 <coughs> <clears throat> so I didn't get anything frozen or anything and yeah nothing that I have that I'm getting at Walmart is going to be cold so I can stay out and not have to go up the stairs and bring this stuff there so oh get directions um we are under a tropical what's it called Tr tropical storm warn warning i didn't know that north carolina my friend was telling me yesterday she was like yeah i think north carolina is gonna get to hit and i was like huh i didn't i didn't think that we were i thought like i didn't, I didn't think we were gonna get hit so my thoughts and my prayers go out to all of you that are in Florida. Ava needs... Wait, do I turn at this light? No. See, this thing's all... What? Okay. Hold on. I turn it this way. Stay light. in the second lane from right. What the... F uh, what? Why do I turn... Why? Why do I not stay in the right lane? At the light. She drives me nuts. She does, cause she'll be like, stay in this lane. And you're like, huh? She literally did not tell me to stay in the right lane. Why not? Lady, you're crazy. Miles. Did I come down this way? Y'all, we've been doing back roads. This, this looks really familiar. Where am I supposed to go? This, this looks like it's gonna take me to 45. I don't wanna go 45. I said avoid all Highways, I just don't want to go. I just don't, don't want to go on the highway. So do I just go straight? Like, what the hell? Oh, I'm so confused. I'm so, I'm so confused. Are you about to bring me on 485? Okay, no. <laughs> All right. This, that, the way that these streets are sometimes, y'all, is so freaking weird. And it's like so confusing when you come from a smaller town and you've got all this like curving like around the interstates and stuff. Oh, if you know, you know. And if you don't, it's confusing sometimes. Okay, we're good. All right, I will see you guys when we get back to the house or in Walmart or I think, like I said, I really do think I'm gonna go and, and get some Panera. So I'll probably see you guys in Panera. So that took literally forever this dude is like standing right there so i can't even back up um i decided on panera okay let me tell y'all something this is so crazy because you know i used i was always like just like a calorie deficit diet right that's how i would lose weight counting calories trying to be in a calorie deficit my go-to <laughs> this is crazy my go-to panera order was always one of those warm grain bowls like um the baja i think it's like a baja chicken there was another one like a mediterranean super delicious it has like quinoa and chicken and dressing it's just really good okay those are my go-to's how about their 18 points ma'am what <laughs> yeah it's just it's just crazy to think like the other day I was like I'm I'm gonna go like we went to Starbucks and I was like I'm gonna go and I'm gonna get a freaking cake pop okay I'm gonna get a cake pop and I go and I look there are 170 calories okay do you want to know how many points is a cake a cake pop is shit this doesn't take me out mm. <laughs> I'm gonna cry nine it was like eight or nine points i'm like you're joking right
Well, it's like so windy out here. It's like the wind is like really starting to pick up. And my foot is also starting to hurt. So apparently, if I stay off of it, it's fine. But the minute that I start walking too much, that's it. It's not cool. <clears throat> So I don't know what to do about my foot. Oh my goodness y'all I forgot how much I love freaking Ross oh they actually have plus size clothes that are cute number one and number two I forgot about their selection of purses which was amazing yes I may or may not have gotten the one that y'all saw saw <laughs> saw me have on in the in the mirror which is dirty as heck um I how about I went into Ulta to get that eyelash glue that I use well <clears throat> I got it from Walmart and they didn't have it in store but they were like hey we can we can ship it to you for free so I was like okay five dollars is what I spent there but I was like since I'm right here by Ulta let's go ahead because I really like that glue and the glue that I'm currently using yesterday this lash was like completely off like in the beginning or in the front of my eye and I was like what the heck is that so <coughs> I was like mm -mm. we need to we need to find some new glue or we need to buy the the glue that we're used to which is actually the same brand which is kind of weird but the glue that I get y'all it like stays and it's good now I did get that house of lashes glue that stuff is too sticky and I found myself not being able to like I don't know if it dries faster than I'm used to but I noticed that my lashes were like all weird when I thought they were on right when you look down it's like it's all off my lash line and so I was like no so need to get some new glue five dollars and 13 cents coming from Walmart but I was like I don't want to wait until Monday let's go ahead and get it girl it was ten, it was no 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 it was eight almost ten dollars it was like 8.99 or something like that 8.50 i was like i picked it up i like went right to it because i always know exactly where the lash glue is and i was like i'm not trying to get tempted to buy anything other than what i came in here for and so i go straight to it and then i looked at that price and i said um how bad do you want this show i was like not this damn bad so I put it back.
my goodness, y'all. What did I say when I started this solo date? Did I say that this was gonna be the best one yet? Because it was the best one yet. Oh my gosh, like I thoroughly enjoyed eating lunch alone. I have really, really just enjoyed myself. Um, I will also have to say that unfortunately, turn right on. <laughs> my foot really hurts. I'm mad at myself because I need to be wearing my little boot thing and I'm not. So it's 100% on me, but it really hurts. But oh my gosh, TJ Maxx. TJ Maxx and what was the other one, Ross? Oh, I forgot how much I love you. Oh, just like, oh. I, I literally, in TJ Maxx, I kid you not, I could have spent four, five hours in there and not been bored. Like, I'm not even kidding you. Oh my gosh. And I'm like sitting here like, where is a Starbucks when you need one? I am dying of thirst because I threw away my cup at Panera because I was like, oh, I'm going to go straight to Starbucks and now I got to go pick up my son and I'm going to be late, which he's, he's fine. He he's a big boy he can wait oh my gosh I cannot get over I, I I did get that Michael Kors shirt because uh, girl I put that thing on and I was like yes you're going home with me you're going home with me like immediately yes and then I tried on the one with the well you guys saw I was gonna get I was gonna get the one with the that one was like I think it was Kate Spade Man, they had some designers in there. I was like, I forgot TJ Maxx because Marshalls is usually like that, but the Marshalls I've been going to, it's not that great. That, ooh, and girl, I forgot I still gotta go to Burlington. I still gotta go to Dollar Tree. My foot is killing me. My son's gonna have to go into Burlington. I'm like, is he though? Is he gonna be able to with my card? Because it's a return. He's probably gonna be like, don't make me go in there by myself. So yeah, best solo date that I've had. I'm gonna go home and we're gonna do a haul cause I got a lot of stuff. So yeah, I will see you guys at home. So y'all, my camera died. So um, I had to go get this handsome boy right here from school, TJ Maxx, amazing. I literally could have spent four hours in there. Um, I'm here, finally, finally I found a Starbucks and I went and I got gas. We're gonna try to find some water bottles. Um, this storm, or this, this wind is picking up and it's apparently gonna be a lot worse than I thought. They canceled school for tomorrow. Um, I mean, it's windy as heck. It's been all day. So yeah, we're under like a storm watch and a flood watch, so. Yeah, hopefully it won't be too bad. But um, yeah, I came here to get my Starbies. I'm like so freaking thirsty. Like I'm never without water. But um, yeah, also freaking like my tire pressure is low. So I'm like, I, I, I don't know what to do. I had to call my dad. I was like, what do I do? And then I was like, do they check that in an oil change? And they said that they should. And they were like, well, when's the last time you got an oil change? And I was like, well, it says up here in January, but I haven't drove 5,000 miles yet. I thought it was like 5,000 miles. I don't know. Maybe it's like 5,000 miles every three months or every three months, whichever comes first or every couple of months. I don't know. But they were like, if you haven't gotten one that long, you need to get it changed. So I'm probably going to get that done. Mm. I don't know if I'm gonna go today or if I'm gonna do that like Saturday. Well, Saturday, Saturday's supposed, supposed to be like pretty stormy too. So I probably will do that on Monday, but I had to tell you I came and I finally got my Starbies at 3.25 p.m. I don't know how people wait in these lines. Actually, I do know. Now that I found a drink, I will wait. I will wait. <laughs> I've gotten Starbucks so much. I mean, I literally just had it. What was it, Tuesday I had it? No, it was Monday because you guys were, were home and you were gone with your friends and me and Ava went and I got it. Mm -hmm. They made it real good. I was like, ooh. But, um, yeah. Yeah, you can try it. 
Um, but it tastes like strawberry milk. It's really good. Oh but gosh. yeah, so we're gonna go to Dollar Tree, return this fountain, exchange this fountain. Hopefully, the one that we get actually works. I gotta go to Burlington. And then I need to go to the grocery store to get some water bottles because I didn't realize I don't have any. So we need to do all that. Ava, we should we should be able to get get all that done before Ava. And then he wants to go to his homecoming game tonight. Wait, why didn't y'all warn me? And and yeah, why didn't y'all warn me that once they like junior year hits, they're they're off doing stuff with their friends all the time. Why didn't y'all warn me? Um, hopefully this line hurries the heck up, but yeah, I will talk to you guys when we get home and I'll show you my haul. Hopefully we get it all uh, in one go round. We made it, or I made it home from Roz. They had some really cute things. Now I didn't try these on, so I don't really know, but this was originally $55, you're gonna be kidding me. This is the brand Ret Retrology. I don't know. By the way, both thumbs, the nails fell off, whatever, it's fine. I feel like I probably have something like this, but whatever. I mean, this is like total Jill style. Should we be putting the trash out there? Because what if it just blows away? Well, I think it would be fine, because the, the trash, well, the trash's not that heavy, but it's whatever. Um, look at how pretty! So yeah, it's all sparkly and it's it's so it's so soft, y'all. It's so soft. So got that. This was $10.99 from Ross. Girl, I love Ross. Like everything is always so inexpensive there. And I also forgot Ross and TJ Maxx always have a really good purse selection. I didn't see any Michael Kors there, but usually they have Michael Kors. Um, so yeah, anyways, I got a purse too, but this was $9.99. And this is 89th and Madison. And this is just so pretty. I absolutely love it. And then the sleeve, of course. How pretty. Gorge, and then I had to, okay, I couldn't. See, here's the thing. Where is that bag? Kintra, where's my bag at? Oh, it's literally an Adidas bag, okay? And I'm just tired of using it, but I want something that's comfortable. I had literally had no intentions on buying a purse today. You don't have to get it, you don't have to get it. Um, <laughs> it's literally like, <clears throat> excuse me, like a sports bag, okay? That's what I carry like on the daily. And I was just like, you know what? I'm just tired of doing that, but I need a big bag. So, and I also need something like y'all, I literally put this on just like this. Y'all saw me in the mirror. I was like, I need to go ahead and take this off before I forget to like walk out with the purse. Cause it's just, it was so comfortable. And it's also really cute. So you have this crossbody right here, which it actually fits really, it hits in a really great place. So it's not too, you know, you know, plus size, you, you know what I'm talking about. But um, it's cute. It has gold hardware. It has pockets on the outside. This is Steve Madden. And it has a button. I mean, it has tons of space. And this is exactly what I need. Like, I need a big bag. Like, I literally carry everything but the kitchen sink in my bag. Like, I mean, I need my water to fit, okay? When I'm walking around these stores, man, I don't want to be buy I don't want to be out buying water already. It's five pounds, but it's okay. It's whatever. <laughs> I mean, that does add. Whew. But, um, I also love the fact that it has this right here, too. So, you can also... Just do like so. So it was really comfortable. It also has this little change purse on the side. There was tons of stuff on here. This was $34.99. So tons of pockets and space and does this detach? No, it doesn't. But yeah, this thing is huge. And it fits my water bottle and it's black. 
You can have this strap or you can do crossbody. And on top of that, I can even go down some more, y'all. So like, again, very, very plus size friendly, big fan. So I was like, I can't leave without getting that. So I got it. This, I'm gonna tell you what, I was like, I treated myself today. I deserve it. I deserve it, darn it. So this was a really, it was a really nice solo date. From TJ Maxx, I got this little oral flosser, which I'm like so excited about. It's like a little water uh, pick kind of thing. So it just says, you know, I don't know like what the brand is, Fine, Fine Life? I don't know. This was $16.99 and then I'm like really big into like anything mint, especially if it's tingly. I'm hoping this tingles, fingers crossed, but let me tell you something. I'm telling you, I could have spent hours in TJ Maxx alone. They had, between all of the clothes, they had such an impressive plus size selection. They had, I mean, their cosmetics and, and face like skincare stuff in their scrubs and body care and hair care like oh my gosh the jewelry I literally purses shoes I mean it was whoa whoa could have literally spent hours probably like five six hours because there's also a home goods attached I didn't even make it on that side y'all oh my gosh and then they had some Christmas things out. My son's like, you coming to get me? I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm still here. I'll be there. And I'm like, whoa, wait. <laughs> oh my gosh, so cute. Anyways, this is a lip sleeping mask. Let me go ahead and tell you right now if it's, if it's minty slash tingly or not. I hope that it is. But yeah, they had some really cute. Hold on. Oh, it feels so good too. No, you cannot have any. She's looking up at me like, she loves the tingle too. I was just I messing with her back. Either, so I got my own. Does yours tingle? I don't need tingle. Uh huh. I love, I love the tingle. I don't know. <laughs> There's something about that tingle that I legit, if I don't have the tingle, I feel like it's literally doing nothing from to my lips. And it's not like super intense, it's just ever so slight, but it's like perfect for at night. So I'm gonna put this in my little bedside table. Um, yeah, I was like walking by and I saw this Christmas stuff and I started, I stopped. It, it, there was this little Christmas tree, I was literally about to pick it up and I'm like, Jill, it's not even October yet. <laughs> keep a walking, keep a walking. But this, you guys saw me try this on and immediately when I put it on, I was like, I, I can't not. Normally I wouldn't, especially like, I mean, it was still, yeah, it's still pretty pricey. Like this is Michael Kors. It says it was originally $110. It was $34.99. I just, again, the way it looked, I was like, I can't not. And, and it looks so basic. Like when you look at it, you know, but I put it on. I was like, oh, this is coming home with me. It has to, it has to. So that's what I got from TJ Maxx. And then, ooh. Trader Joe's, Trader Joe's, Trader Joe's. So, I got these. How cute are these? Guys, look. Cool. I think I'm more, are you excited about these? So, yeah, seven points on WW, so, which pasta, pasta always is, but I think these are so cute. We love shapes in this house. What, we love shapes? Shapes, like we pasta shapes. shapes. Pasta shapes? Um, Do you not love pasta shapes? I think it's, shapes? I, think it's mm. I know it's Ava does too. For me, I mean, like, it's good. I love, okay, maybe it's just me. I like, I feel like it, different, different shapes just taste better to me. Um, Do they not? The other day, Ava said she wanted elbows or she wanted because she didn't want. So I think Ava's with me on that. Anyways, I think that these are gonna taste delicious because of the shape. And they're also butternut squash. But I was really excited because I want to try this. I hear that this is 
not that it's like, oh, this is so good and it's definitely like pasta, but what I like to do things like this for, like zoodles or not butternut squash, but spaghetti squash, is to bulk up my pasta. Because if you've actually ever eaten an actual just one serving of pasta, it's pretty small. But this, for the whole entire package, is 60 calories. You can't beat that. So I'll let you guys know how that tastes. And then again, normally I am not a pumpkin lover or anything. It's the autumnal harvest creamy pasta sauce made with pumpkin and butternut squash. So it looks like so. I'm, I'm really excited to try this. And that was, all of that was $9.97. So that wasn't too bad for those three items. And then let me show you what I got. By the way, this is the best dry shampoo. I got this from Walmart. I got this from my son. Someone recommended this to me because I was talking about how he was like, he really needed something intense. Um, and he's been doing great with this. Kentrell, you want your deodorant? I went and switched out Ava's fountain. You're welcome. Um, I don't really know if like what I got from Walmart is really that exciting. I just got bread for the kids and then I got the 45 calorie Sara Lee bread to, is it two points per? I think it's two points for two slices, I believe. I can't remember. And then I think this is zero or one points, but it is sugar-free strawberry preserves. I actually wanted the Smuckers. Actually, I think the Smuckers was zero, but they were out of the Smuckers. Let me see. Yeah, this is one point. Let me see if the Smuckers, what the Smuckers was. Okay, that's one point too. So yeah, one point, but that's really all I got from Walmart. I got some Cinnamon Toast Crunch from Food Lion. And, oh, Starbucks. I think that this is the tea that they use for the drink that I buy. And I wanna kinda try to make it myself. Do you guys know how I can make the sweet cream at home? Because I would love to start making that at home. I would literally drink that every single day. I tried looking for sugar-free vanilla syrup. I know I have which one is this? I have a caramel syrup, but I don't know how caramel would taste. And I always do the vanilla, the sugar-free vanilla, whenever I get that from Starbucks. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Um, I definitely still want to get something. And then I also got a rotisserie chicken from Food Lion as well. But on to the Weight Watchers goodies. Okay. So these are the things that I bought, okay? I bought this, which is a popcorn popper. So basically you, I'll try to see if I can link this if you're, if you're interested, but it's like silicone. And the lady said that it has measuring on the sides. So you can measure I don't really see it, but I know that if, I know you can do popcorn as a zero point food if you wanted to. I don't know how this works, cause it doesn't even fit. Maybe this goes out on the bottom, how, I don't know. Fill lines for easy measuring. I don't see the lines that they're talking. Oh, okay, 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 I see the bottoms. I see them, they're on the bottom. I don't know if you can see them. So anyways, what she said she does is she pops popcorn and she does it in this. And then she takes this, which, which is the chocolate marshmallow puffs. And when the popcorn is hot, she takes a pack and she just like crushes it up and then puts it over the popcorn. So it's like salty sweet. I was like, give it to me now. And then I also got this which is the buttery caramel corn popcorn seasoning. So I'm excited to try that out. I will let you guys know what I think. And 
with purchasing those three things, I got this for free because I had like some kind of promotion where you get, it was like you got a choice of three different snacks and this is the one that I chose because they said these ones were the best. So I'm assuming these are kind of like Doritos uh, for 80 calories. And I don't know how many points. I'm assuming they don't put the points. Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah, it's two points. So, yeah. Not bad, especially because um, regular bags of chips are five points. Do y'all want to see what I got for free? Okay, so I got my little welcome to WW. Okay. Gives me, like, all the, in the, all the info. And then this was for free, okay? I'm also getting sent to me a scale, like not a food scale, but a body weight scale. Like I can trash, well actually I'll probably just give it to my kids, but I've had that scale since I was pregnant with Ava and I got it. It was actually right before I got pregnant with her because I was like, I'm on my grind, I'm gonna lose this weight, this and that, this and that. So I got that scale and then I found out I was pregnant. I was like, oh, <laughs> so I've had that scale for a really long time. Anyways, these were free. So I was like, heck yeah, wait. No, I didn't buy. I was gonna buy these because they were also on sale two for 12, but I was like, if I like them, then I'm probably gonna go and buy them on Saturday. But they have this one, the mint cookie crunch. They say it tastes like a, what's it called? Girl Scout cookie, like the mint, mint, thin mints. And then you got the chocolate peanut butter pie and the caramel, the chocolate caramel. I want to try one of these so bad. They're two points for a bar. So I'll let you guys know what I think of these. And then they also gave me this and the totes. Ava, do you like this tote? I might just give this to Ava. Oh, wait, it says this right on the other side. Oh, you don't? It says, I've got this, which I do. I've got this. All right, I also got this. Um, which is an eight pack variety box. I also got three, three free months of, of WW y'all like, okay, just give me all this free stuff. I'm fine. They also gave me a little mini, um, sample of this one as well. Like when I signed up. So yeah, we've got salt and vinegar potato chips. So we've got two of those. We've got three of the sea salt hummus crisps. And then we've got two of the barbecue potato crisps. I'm excited, how many points are these? Two points. So that is everything that I got today. Okay, Whew, now I got a mess. We also got some bottled water because we're not sure. We are in, we are under, is it a warning or a watch? I think it's an actual storm warning. So um, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. Um, I love you guys. I hope that you had an amazing day. This was the best solo date ever. Loved it. Had so much fun. I thoroughly enjoyed my own company. And not once did I ever feel like I wish there was someone else here with me. And I find that that's like, there's so much growth in that because I can remember six years ago being like, how am I going to leave this man? I'm going to like, how am I ever going to leave him? And here I am, like, I just moved two states. And on top of that, I'm like doing things and I enjoy doing things alone. Like I just, I never in a million years thought I would be here. So if you're in a place where, you know, you feel like you won't ever grow, just do the work and I promise you will. I promise you will. All right, I, I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget, links down below for glassesusa.com. Go get you some glasses and some contacts. And I will link everything that I can think of to link down below that you guys saw. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. There should be a video on Tuesday. If it's not on Tuesday, it's gonna be on Thursday, okay? So we're gonna get back to our regularly Sunday, Tuesday, and possibly even a Thursday video here. Yeah, here until November or so. 
um because i'm like really behind but yeah love you guys thank you for being patient and you know all of that have an amazing day and i'll see you in the next one bye